hello guys welcome back to the channel so guys today we are making avocado oil guys so that is our pan we using for the oil and this is our avocado and that is our plate actually so guys we'll go ahead and actually cut the avocado into two in order to bring out the fruit inside So guys, I removed the shaft from the avocado. So guys, the next step is that you probably mix your avocado into a paste form. So guys, the next step is that I'm adding my cold pressed coconut oil into the pan. Comment down below if you want me to make a video on how to produce your coconut oil. So guys, the next thing you do is that, of course, you have to add your avocado into the pan. That is why it's called avocado oil. After you are done adding it, then you are like to done to cook. <laughs> if I say done, you are like to cook for some time. When they are properly cooked, like we have seen the oil coming out already. So guys, to save the oil, you can get a saving paper or anything at all that can serve the purpose of saving the oil. There is no specialty involved in this process. Just get a clean material for it. Then the next thing you do is that you pour the already cooked oil into your clean clothes or saving paper or anything at all you are using. This next thing is to actually press out the oil from the clothes. You have to really press it hard <laughs> to get out all the oil from inside. No one have to be wasted. Yeah, press it. This is our avocado oil. So the next thing we do is that you have to store it in any container of your choice in any container of your choice so this is our avocado oil so guys this is our avocado oil it's great for the hair it helps to prevent dry scalp it helps to increase hair growth and guess what guys it's still good for the skin it's very nice for the skin to the skin to glow so guys this avocado oil can last up to six months with proper storage so guys if you want to see more videos like this don't forget to subscribe comment like and i can't wait to see you in my next one bye bye